If there was one thing that every machine learning practitioner had to know, it would be how to minimize a function. Whether you're training a neural network, solving logistic regression, or simply trying to teach a computer how to tell a cat from a dog, chances are, after a lot of really complex looking math, your test will boil down to minimizing one gigantic function. Geometrically, this means finding the lowest point on the function graph. Gradient descent is an extremely popular minimization algorithm. It is iterative, which means that instead of finding the solution all at once, it starts at the random location and then takes repeated steps trying to improve its results. Of course, looking at this simple function, this might seem rather unnecessary. But what if your function looks something like this? Without an obvious solution, iterative algorithms become much more attractive. First, we select a random starting point, after which we'll need to come up with a sequence of steps that will take us to the minimum. Gradient descent always moves in the direction of the steepest descent. To gain some intuition, imagine the function graph as a mountain. And let's place a ball on its side. Under the force of gravity, it will naturally start rolling in the direction of the steepest descent.